A lot of people know that Gallup is famous for presidential approval ratings. But what they don't know is that's not what our founder's greatest interest was. Dr. George Gallup said that there were five billion ways to live a life and we should study them all. His passion was about understanding how data can help leaders make better decisions. Today at Gallup, what we've continued to do for the past 80 years is apply that innovative approach to gathering valid information on human behavior and trying to understand at a level deeper than most how that human behavior plays out in the real world. Now we study it at the individual level, the organizational level, the country level here in the United States, and at the global level. And in fact, now we're constantly studying what people are thinking, what they're doing, how they're behaving in 160 countries every single year. Often we're brought in to solve a problem, whether that is understanding how a society is doing, how a certain group within a society is doing economically, politically, but also how a company is doing, how are employees doing within that company. Right now, leaders are overwhelmed with traditional economic data. They know whether or not people have jobs, they know what they're spending. The problem is, is they don't know what they're thinking. I think at Gallup, what differentiates us is we're trying to create the same official statistics, not for the economy, but for behavioral economics and well-being. Leaders need our research because we know the people they serve and lead better than anyone. Gallup has been following the pulse of the global population since 2005 on metrics that range from food and security to law and order to the workplace to opportunities for employment and how people perceive their societies to be transitioning from one phase to another. And the best organization in the world in terms of understanding how people are thinking is Gallup. And it's because we go to the source themselves, they're people.